Welcome to our exploration of the Black Death, a pandemic that reshaped medieval society and marked a significant event in world history. The Black Death, originating in Asia and spreading to Europe in the 14th century, claimed millions of lives, drastically altering the social, economic, and cultural fabric of medieval Europe. This pandemic, believed to have started in Asia over 2,000 years ago, spread through trade routes, reaching Europe via trading ships carrying goods and infected rats. The trading ships, crucial for maritime commerce, became breeding grounds for fleas carrying the deadly bacteria, subsequently spreading the disease to humans in port cities. Densely populated areas with unsanitary conditions facilitated rapid disease spread, leading to devastating mortality rates and widespread panic. Recent research suggests that the pathogen responsible for the Black Death might have existed in Europe before the pandemic, possibly circulating at lower levels. Understanding the historical context, including the role of trade routes, is crucial to grasping how the Black Death reshaped medieval society. Symptoms of the Black Plague included painful swellings called buboes, high fever, chills, aches, vomiting, diarrhea, and potential complications like bloodstream or lung infections. The Black Death was highly contagious, spreading through direct human contact, flea bites, and rats, with port cities playing a significant role in its transmission. Yersinia pestis, the bacterium responsible for the Black Death, spread through rat fleas and respiratory transmission, causing rapid community infections. Modern understanding of the Black Death's transmission has led to effective treatments and preventive measures, like antibiotics and improved sanitation. Despite advances in medicine, vigilance is necessary as the Black Death still poses a threat in regions with prevalent rodent and flea populations. During the medieval period, treatments were primitive and often harmful, including bloodletting, boil lancing, and superstitious practices like burning herbs or bathing in rose water. Physicians of the time had limited disease knowledge, relying on traditional practices that frequently exacerbated the patient's conditions. In addition to medical attempts, superstitious practices aimed at warding off the disease included rituals and beliefs with little impact on actual disease treatment. The pervasive fear and lack of understanding led many to view the Black Plague as divine punishment, influencing the religious and cultural responses to the pandemic. Our journey through the history of the Black Death highlights its profound impact on medieval society and its lasting effects on the modern world. Understanding this historical pandemic provides insights into the development of public health measures and the human response to widespread disease threats. Join us as we continue to explore significant historical events and their lasting impact on our world.